right, here we go. Back in action tonight, the 203 Truck Series brought to you by Justin Smolden, your pole sitter there out of California. Jesse Gordon rocking that capsule time Batman machine there. Brandon out there, Falcon Motorsports with uh, Chaos tonight in that number two spot. Three adjusted Smolden in the open wheel Mafia Choice Inc. Esports machine. Brandon Parks there in that number four spot for next level racers. Chris there in the number five spot, part of Chaos tonight. Anthony Monroe, owner and operator of Broken Axle Motorsports in the number six. The seven of Andrew out there tonight, Irwin Motorsports there. Uh, the eight spot of Cole Howard in the H&H &H Racing. Number nine of Rafe out there tonight for Broken Axle Motorsports. Joshua in the 10 for Chaos. Loon in the 11 for Broken Axle. Joshua Divers in that number 12 spot for Chaos tonight. 13 going to Adam Hur for the next level racers. 14 of Michael out of Texas. In your number 15 spot, back there, Mr. Ballard himself out of the Mid-South Division. All right, drivers going on the track. It's 83 degrees here tonight, 17% humidity, clear and two-mile-an-hour winds. A big thanks again to Justin Smolden for being the title sponsor, being the continued support that he is week in and week out. All right, B1 to green. The boys have been set, ready to go. All right. We understand. We'll put the best times up there. We'll put the gaps up there. Excuse me. 30 laps here tonight is the call. Tons of great drivers out here. 15 or 16 of them made the show here tonight right after Thanksgiving break. So a lot of action ready to take place here. This is the new Atlanta. So it's like a miniature super speedway. Brandon and Jesse front row. Remember, the leader chooses when to go. The pace car veers to the left. He can go whatever he wants as long as he maintains pace speed. Do not check out my field tonight. Let's go. All right, Brandon and Gordon, front row, 83, number 10. It's on Jesse to go when he wants, and he's ready to fire him off here in Atlanta. Let's go racing, boys. Green flag out. Everybody else kind of following suit right now. The 46 and the 52. 18 into 5 right now. Great battle up front. They'll pursue. Side by side they go. Good break right there. Jesse Gordon out front in the number 10. Brandon back there in the number 2. And here comes Smolden. Hold into the inside right now. Guys are trying to sneak their line in. Where do they want to go? Right now, you're seeing it. The 10 of Jesse Gordon, your leader. Brandon there on the outside line. Who wants it more? Both lines bumping. Lap number one in the books here at Atlanta. Oh, man. Some of the best that we got in the league racing here tonight. We'll see how green we stay. You guys want to be patient with each other in the back. You see the running order there. Jesse Gordon, Bedford there in the two. Smolden Parks and Monroe. Round out your top five here at Atlanta. Anthony Monroe in the 82 on the bottom side there of Brandon Parks, owner and operator of Next Level Racers into 28. And Anthony looking to go three wide here on the bottom, and he'll poke it down there and try to make it stick. And that was a gutsy move here early, trying to get up there three wide on the bottom. Not going to make any friends that way. Anthony Monroe still on the bottom side right now. Jesse Gordon there right in front of him. Looks like Brandon's going to make that pass cleanly. He's your new leader. We got him looped around in the back here. Caution out on the speedway. Let's take a look at what we got going on here. What move was made? Oh, man. We got a tip drill right here. Let's take a look at what happened. Looks like we got Adam Hur here possibly coming off the apron here. And Oh, boy. Got one coming down the track there on him. Boom. 46. Right in front of him here. Who is this 46? Here, let's pull it up here. Be Chris trying to close the gap. Boom. All right. Yeah, he gets kind of kind of comes right down in there. All right, that's gonna be on the 46. Of Chris there. Adam was right down there. He came right into him there, unfortunately. Boom. Oh man. Yeah, there's no looking at it. It's you brought out the caution. So first one of the night. All right, moving to the tail end of the field. All right, so there you go. Brings out our first caution here. All right, Brandon out front right now. 
Pacing. We're back to pacing, boys. I pacing. So there we go. Brand. Yep. 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 You got it. Yes, sir. Let me go ahead and take care of Mr. Joshua Divers here. Okay. There we go. All right. So. 5 and 30 in the books here in Atlanta. First caution out there. A couple guys tore up in the back there. Working their way up right here. Who, who keeps queuing up on my mic? I, don't, I need to know who's queuing up on my mic. Okay. All right. So here comes Chris out of the pits right here. Jesse, Brandon, Anthony, Smolden, Cole. Everybody else working their way out of the pits right now. Coming out of the three, so we're going to go one more time around. We'll let them loose here. All right, so Jesse up on the high side, Brandon on the inside. There's Parks, Monroe, Smolden, Cole, Andrew, Rafe, Loon, Joshua, Michael, Divers, Adam, Bailey. And Chris back here at the 46. So, all right. Lights will go off the pace car this time by. There we go. Perfect. If they didn't go off, I was going to shut them off. All right. 25 laps left to go here. Loon still in the pits. Oh, he came down the pits just now. So, that might be a black flag. I'm sure the pits were closed. Tough break. All right, let's see what these guys got. Brandon out front in the 83. He's got Jesse on the outside of him. Brandon Parks there. Monroe, Smolden, Cole, and Rafe in your top seven. Going to go green this time by. I do love me some good pacing laps. We got Xfinity cars coming up next right after this race at Kentucky. Like Xfinity and you like... Kentucky. You should be in for a dandy. All right, here we go. Pace cars coming off. Brandon and Gordon, front row. Brandon can choose to go whenever he wants when that pace car veers off. Let's see what he's going to decide to do here. Looking side by side start here from everybody. Green flag, green flag. Good start right there. Brandon taking advantage of the whole line there, and he'll go ahead and do that. He's out to a good start there. Parks going to the inside also. Brandon Parks to the inside of Jesse Gordon. Anthony Monroe back there in that number four spot. A little bump drip. <laughs> yeah yeah I saw what happened you tried to get in there the first time you're good I cleared it Adam right there Michael Divers Ballard also in the mix here right now these guys are trying to just find their way around the Atlanta 23 laps left to go battle up front Brandon Parks in that number two spot Monroe in the three Jesse Gordon now in the four Getting slicey. Oh, man. Big wreck. Big, big wreck right here. A lot of torn up race cars right here. Let's rewind it back and see what we got here. Hold up here. All right. Let's see what they have here. Oh, boy. Looks like. Boom. So we're riding here. Oh, yeah, damn, that's definitely, that sucks right there. So both drivers, boom. Oh, man, there's nowhere for him to go here. So let's take a look at Parks' truck here. All right. Riding. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, tough break right there. 
gets right into the back side of them. See here. Want to make sure we got our best shot here. So Anthony's holding his line here. Uh huh. Let's see here. Boom. Gets right up into him right there. Boom. Yep. Gets him turned right there. So. Looking at what we got to make the call here, and it looks like Anthony held his line here. Parks held his line, so that one's going to be on Brandon Parks. All right, that one's going to be on Parks there. Came back across the nose. Anthony maintained possession of the line the whole time. First one of the night, Brandon Parks. All right. Tail in here. Boom, boom, boom. Yep. It was a long review, but we looked at it the best we could. All right, 21 laps left to go here. Brandon, Smolden, Josh, Michael, Chris, Loon, Rafe, Andrew, and Jesse Gordon. Things are getting dicey. All right, yeah, a couple guys came through the pits there, had tons of blacks there, so everybody should be squared away. All right, everybody should be squared away here. Like I said, you should be locked in, ready to go here, man. Let's finish it out strong. All right, Brandon, Smolden, Josh, Michael, Chris, Loon, Rafe, and Gordon, Andrew, Anthony, and Ballard. So we'll go green next time by. All right. Zoe's place right there. Beautiful looking paint scheme right there. Awesome. All right. These guys are ready to go. We'll fire them off here next time by. All right. Smolden's up here. He's moving up. Yeah, big crash right there, man. Huge break there. A lot of action right there. We kind of watched the camera there with that last one, and it was uh, it was tight nerve picking right there. But, hey, you're going to have what you got. So Brandon and Smolden on the front row here. Brandon in the 83. Of course, Smolden in the 203. Joshua and Michael there in that 3 and 4 spot. Chris in the 5. And Josh Loon has moved his way all the way up to the number 6 spot. But your big mover is in the 33 there, Michael Barea. Looking fantastic, up 10 spots tonight. So dominating performance from him and everybody over there on Team 33. All right, well, a lot of guys in the pits here. Parks in the pits, Brandon, and Divers. Oh, man, a lot of torn up cars. A lot of good trucks in the pits here tonight. All right, pace car is going to go in. It's going to be on Brandon. He's ready to fire. Absolutely. Looks like they're able to get rolling off there, Cole and uh, Brandon Parks. They're working their way back around right now. Here we go. Good start right there. Green flag out. Oh, a little tire spinning in the back there. Gordon able to get up and around them. By side they go. Gordon getting slung up there into the wall on the high side, but he's able to find his way back up there. Brandon, your leader right now. Joshua and Chris in that number two and three spot. Good battle happening right here. Jump into the cockpit with the Monster Energy car. Riding with Andrew in the 14. Awesome looking shot there. You see everybody get fanned out three wide down the back stretch. The 18 trying to find its way back on the track after going below the apron. He's able to do it. The Montana driver. 18 laps left to go. Brandon, your leader. Joshua in the two. The 203 is Smolden digging. 17 laps left to go here at Atlanta. Brandon, the man out front for chaos tonight. It's molded on the outside. It looks like he'll take the lead. Molded going to take the lead for a second in that middle lane. Nobody to help him. 
The 33 of Michaels right there with him. He'll try to close the gap a little bit. 16 to go this time by. Michael going all the way to the top. The three trying to find the lane. A big move there from Anthony. Trying to dip it down low and go with the five with Chaos. All right, now the 203 line moving up there on the high side. Justin Smolden out front. Brandon into two. Beating and banging all across the back here. Great battle up front. Brandon back out front right now by a half a truck. 15 laps left to go. Who's going to make that move with about five to go? We'll see. Right now, everybody just wants to make it to the end. Just be patient with each other. Because at least your top 10 guys right now have a chance legitimately at winning this race. One bad move from these drivers up front can take everybody out. And their race will be over. Three wide men row on the bottom. Anthony now sliding his way up to the number two spot. Anthony Monroe right behind the 83. Anthony looking to peak maybe low, but nothing going to be there right now. Going to be looking for a good side suck there as he gets into the 10. Contact made. Anthony Monroe, Jesse Gordon. Looks like Anthony's going to play with death here on the bottom end of the apron. And he'll take it to the inside. Side by side. Anthony gets down there and we said plays with death. Was it worth it this early to go that low as he falls all the way back to the seventh spot? Anthony Monroe all the way to the back. Three wide up front. Michael down low. Smolden in the middle. Jesse Gordon to the high side. Great battle right here. Oh, contact made. Oh, man. Big wreck. Big, big wreck right there. Let's see what they got. Contact made right here. You know when you're on three wide and you're on the wall, you're living on the edge. Absolutely. Oh, man. So this truck just goes up the track here. Gets right into him here. As we take a look here, we'll bring your cam down here. I don't know if he just loses talent. I'm not sure. That's first one on Brandon there in the 83. Running into the 203, and unfortunately, big one happened. He said, I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That would, uh... This guy is okay. Let me, let me. All right. That was on Brandon there. Sorry about that. I had to mute the guy. All right. Uh, let me see here. Okay. So he's, he obviously left. So he's, he's admitting default there. Okay. All right. Uh, let me move him to the tail end anyway. So let's do that. Okay. All right. So there you go. Tough break there, man. A lot of torn up. Yeah. <laughs> This is tough. Yeah, you ain't kidding. Yeah, yeah, I didn't make it three wide, but he did, and he couldn't hold it. I had plenty of room. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, there was a lot of mistakes there made on the bottom side. Nothing on your end. You didn't give. You didn't do anything wrong, Gordon. You did fine. I mean, the the guy on the bottom just kind of lost talent there and went into the 203, and obviously Smolden had nowhere to go, so. Yeah, you'll have that. Okay, so Chris out front in the 46. Joshua and Loon there, your top three. Andrew in the four, the five of Adam Her. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you ain't kidding. All right, Chris, Joshua, Loon, Andrew. All these boys ready to go here. Got some guys coming down pits right now. Going to have to get some service done. Next time by, we'll let them loose. 11 to go. Oh, yeah. 100%. So Chris out front, Joshua, and there's Mr. Loon himself. He's up eight spots for the capsule of time there. Chaos sitting 1-2 right now, looking fantastic. Yeah, there's nothing you could have done, Gordon. You did everything right. You were up there running your line, and just uh, the bottom line just bloop. 
fell off. But it happens. Like I said, long season. Well, not really. But this series, but yeah. Not really long, but you know what I mean. Plenty of time. All right, Chris, Joshua, Loon, Andrew, Adam, and Michael. Top five. See what these guys got. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, 100%. No, 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 no. I think it'd be all right. All right, Chris out front. Joshua in the two spot on the outside of him. Loon and Andrew. Let's see what these guys got. 10 lap shootout. Xfinity coming up next at Kentucky. Might be a little more dangerous than this. Third caution, though. We'll see what happens. All right. Looks like Chris is going to see what this line's going to do. And good start for him. He'll go straight to the bottom. Joshua there on the outside. And everybody else kind of following suit here. Working their way around. Everybody had their stuff cleared. Let's go. Chris, Joshua, Loon, Andrew, Monroe, Michael, and Adam right there in the back. Apron ain't nothing to play with. Oh, man, getting swirly back there. Nine laps left to go. The five and the 169 getting swirly. That apron, man, ain't nothing to mess with. The 33 is coming up like a rocket. He's got tons of fresh tire. Chris, still your leader out front. Loon into two. Loon trying to get up here and get a good go in here, but I don't know if that high line is going to take it. Oh, Loon runs into Josh. Three wide for a second. Big wreck in the back there. Big, big, big wreck. Yeah, we saw that. There it is on Josh Lane, first one of the night. All right, moving to the tail end of the field here. We'll go back and take a look at it for you folks at home that may be wondering what the hell happened. So Josh Loon gets up here and forgets there's a turn right here. He's like, oh, shit. He just ran into the chaos guy. and Yeah, unfortunately, that caused a gigantic pileup. So no harm, no foul. First one of the night for Josh Loon as he'll bring that thing down pit road here tonight. All right, still out front with seven to go. Chris, Michael, Anthony. So I tell you, Michael was coming like a rocket, dude. He's up 12 spots in that 33. That thing was hauling the mail tonight, dude. He got some fresh tires and never looked back. Michael there in that number two spot. Anthony Monroe in the three. Lucky dog coming high, he said. Lucky, lucky, lucky. All right. Everybody will come through the pits, get themselves situated here next time by. Not this time. We'll do one lap of pacing and we'll get back to it here. In case there's somebody who wants to take it. But right now, it looks like we got about five guys in the pits. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not. It is what it is. I mean, it just, it happens. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not, I'm not one bit concerned by the racing tonight. I mean, we took a week off and guys coming back. Yeah. Yeah. Things happen. There's no worries here. Everybody's, everybody's still just getting to go in here, you know? All right. Chris, Michael, Anthony, Andrew, Rafe, Smolden, Joshua. No, I mean, like I said, I mean, shit's going to happen. It is. It's a super speedway race. You know what I mean? All right. Big torn up car. So next time by, we'll go green here. So Chris will go across the line. We'll turn off the lights on the pace car. We'll get these guys resituated. Yeah, Kentucky should be a little more fun, a little more uh, down to earth, I would say, with the Xfinity cars. If guys stick around, they end up running that. 
That should be a fun one. All right, so the lights are off the pace car. Chris, your leader, Michael in the two, mid-row there in that number three spot. Andrew back there, Rafe, Joshua, and there is Smolden. A lot of action here. Five to go. Anybody's race here tonight, man. We'll see what's going to happen. Oh, absolutely. Chris is going to wait for that pace car to veer off to the left and use the control truck. Couple guys in the pits. Looks like we got about five guys still in the pits, unfortunately. So that's that's a rough break, man. You hate to see it for some of these guys. Adam getting back there, trying to get caught up to the field. Here we go. Oh, absolutely. All right, good start right there. Chris off to a good start. No tires spinning for him, looks good. Michael Monroe and there's Andrew. Andrew back here trying to hold it down in that number four spot, racing for points. Anthony there in the three and we're back in the single file through the front. Four laps left to go here, the 33. Up on the high side, Anthony bouncing around like a pinball. Anthony Monroe in the 82, Backwoods Vacation. Tight battle right here, second, third, fourth, and fifth. Chris, still your leader. Michael on the outside in the blue 33. Anthony Monroe on that bottom line, second car. 82. Three laps to go. They've straightened them out back there. Holding on to it up there. I heard some tires screeching. I wasn't sure. Two laps left to go. Andrew to the bottom. Right now, moving their way up. Oh, man, side by side right there. Andrew trying to find his way. Chris trying to hang on. Oh, the 18 wrecked him. The 18 got to the back side of him. Anthony Monroe got wrecked by his own teammate, it looked like. White flag out for Chris. Andrew in the two. Smolden in the three. We'll have to go back and look at it. Woo-hoo-hoo. <laughs> 203 looking to get a good push here. Boom, what a block. Puts it down in there. Chris, your leader. Rafe, in that number two spot right now. Anthony Monroe hanging on to the three. It's going to be Chris wins it. Rafe in the two. Anthony Monroe in the three. Top three. We will be looking at it, obviously. It's going to be Chris, Rafe, and Monroe. Park up on the front stretch, please. Oh, oh, we got to go back. We got to go back and take a look at what happened here. Okay, so let's go back and, uh, oh, man. So let's take a look at what Anthony was talking about right here. Let's just go back and so the 18 gets right into the back of the 33 here. Boom. So let's take a look here. Boom. Let's pull it back. Boom. Oh, boy. They get swirly right here. Oh, they both get swirly. Oh, man. Then he throws them into the 82. Then back up to the front right here. Get that camera right here. Oh, man. Oh, right there. What happened with Smolden? 
Smolden comes to make a move and he just clips him in the ass. And oh man, that's rough. All right, let's get these top three up here. All right. All right, he's parking it. <laughs> yeah, that was a that was a hard hit right in the back. All right, let's start off with the third place driver out here tonight uh, in the 82. Anthony Monroe, you got a copy. Hey, luckily, got up there up to the P3 here, man, up three spots where he started to race here and looked like it was going to be done for you there once Rafe made contact with the 33 and he came down to India, but you're able to hang on to the P3, man, break down your run here tonight. Yeah, I, I, I definitely had a, a fast truck. Um, definitely felt like I was kind of robbed a little bit. Um, I understand, though, that, you know, well, on, on this track of Atlanta, especially with the, with the draft, you got to, you know, I mean, it's real hard to, to check up as quick as you need to sometimes. And uh, just a little tap is all it takes to send somebody around and everybody makes mistakes. Uh, but, I mean, all, all in all, it was a decent run. Um, but other than that, I mean, it is what it is. Absolutely. Who would you like to thank tonight, Anthony? Well, of course, uh, CapitalTimeLLC.com, uh, 614 Setups, and uh, 614 Designs, and uh, Mark Brittany, and all the guys back at Broken Excel. Oh, sorry, graphics, my bad. There you have it, Anthony Monroe, P3 here tonight. Great work. Whatever, now to your second place drive out of Montana. Rafe, you got a copy? I do. Well, it looked a little jousty there between you and 33. You got swirly, and then, of course, you couldn't check up in time, and it sent him down into Anthony, and uh, that about cost him his race. But, unfortunately, we had another incident there near the end and uh, slid you up there into the P2, man. Great race, and, uh, man, break it down for us. Yeah, with all the wrecks, I was trying to stay in the back until we got the last one, and I figured it was time to go. Um, I, I did try bumping him there. Uh, I thought it benefited both of us, but... He got a little squirrely right as I was up on him, and I guess he just couldn't handle that. Um, tried tried getting, uh, uh, I don't know what his name is, Chris, but couldn't get him. Absolutely. Job well done out here tonight. And who would you like to thank, Rafe? Uh, Capital of Time, LLC, uh, 614 Setups, 614 Graphics, uh, all the Broken Knuckles guys, and you heard about number league. Absolutely. There you have it. Rafe bringing it home and P2 here tonight. All right. We would look over here at our first place driver, Chris, but he ended up getting his mic muted during the race because he um, we didn't stop using it. So unfortunately for him, he doesn't have it here. But congratulations again on Chris uh, winning it here tonight. First race uh, part of that chaos team over there getting it done here tonight out of Indiana. Congratulations again. All right. So there you have it. Chris wins it. Rafe in the two and Monroe rounds out your top three. Great work, boys.